Um, so yeah, so quantum computers basically use the principles of quantum mechanics in order to compute things. And so instead of using like a normal traditional transistor that's either off or on, a quantum transistor can be off or on or a superposition of anywhere in between. So it's like a state, a state with without being a full state almost. Yeah, like yeah. a state of matter, but without being a it, state. That, that's actually true because that's what we call an uncollapsed wave function in, oh. in quantum mechanics. So like in quantum mechanics, you may have heard that like a particle could be in two places at the same time before it's measured. You know, so we're kind of we're kind of taking advantage when, when we're building quantum computers. Uh, these organizations like Google or Microsoft or IBM. Uh, they're, they're basically utilizing the principles of quantum mechanics to be able to build stronger and stronger computers that can calculate things so much faster than a traditional computer. 